Hey, happy holidays from Pepe and me, Maronica. Look, I just wanted to send a heartfelt hello to everyone whose Christmas has been turned upside down by COVID around the world. I know there's so many of you who are sitting at home by yourselves, sitting in isolation or quarantine, or aren't with loved ones or doing the plans you had. And I really, really wish you the very best for Christmas. And while I've never lived through a pandemic, I have had a few Christmas plans disrupted in my life and thought I'd share with you some of the fun and the stories of things I've managed to create instead. So I've had Christmas wearing this exact elf hat laying in this lounge room with my family around me, as you can see in the photo. The fastest thing I've learned about disruptions to Christmas is the barrier between where we are now and being happy for Christmas is letting go of our idea of how Christmas should be in the first place. Once you do that, pretty much anything is possible. You can see photos of Christmas in the hospital. I had major surgery to save my life two days before Christmas. So look what we did. We decorated the room before my surgery. The drip pole is holding decoration. I don't know what you're going through right now, but I found for me, the last thing I wanted to get over and over again in a hospital when I was in a room by myself was everyone coming in, oh, how much does it suck to be in hospital? I just wanted to have a good time with anybody I talked to. So this is how I got the team of folk around me to be on board with how I wanted to celebrate. And you may not be a Christmas or a New Year's decorating nutter like me, and that's okay, you do it your way. But I think the key takeaways is training the people around you to understand how it how they can support you to have the christmas new year and holiday that you want that works for you and also when we let go of our idea of how christmas should be we can let go of when christmas should be i have had some amazing christmases completely at the wrong time of the year one for exa an example we can all relate to right now family overseas in the cayman islands in holland could be in Australia, but it was November. So November 25, complete Christmas set up. Awesome party. We all remember it as if it was Christmas day. And the other one, I was recovering from surgery. My housemate was in hospital. We had complete Christmas and it's in February. Spoiling hot, just like it is in December. You would never know from the photos, would you? This isn't Christmas. We actually remember it like Christmas. We just let go of the need for it to be December 25. So I hope maybe some of these ideas have given you a clue for something you could maybe do instead after you get out of quarantine or isolation. So Joy and Noel, Merry Christmas, but my heart goes out to you. It's really hard to have those plans turned upside down. So let's try, try and find out a way to turn the frown upside down too and celebrate today or over the new year period or another time. Hope to hear from you about what you're doing for your Christmas. Let me know in the comments below. Happy Christmas and happy holidays.